NASA's Space Launch System, or SLS, is designed to take humans back to the moon. It's part of NASA's Artemis program, aiming for a lasting lunar presence. However, the future of SLS is uncertain. Its development cost, $23.8 billion, is a concern. The SLS is the most powerful rocket ever built. Despite its capabilities, it faces criticism. Each launch costs over $4 billion. The SLS program faces a critical juncture. Its future depends on political support and competition. Boeing, the prime contractor for the SLS core stage, has issued a stark warning. The aerospace giant says that thousands of jobs are at risk due to uncertainties surrounding the rocket's future. The company faces potential layoffs and contract terminations. Boeing's announcement highlights the economic consequences. The SLS program supports a vast network of suppliers and subcontractors spread across the country, relying on the program for revenue and employment. Canceling or significantly scaling back the SLS would have ripple effects throughout the aerospace industry. The potential job losses extend beyond Boeing and its direct suppliers. The SLS program also supports jobs in sectors such as manufacturing, engineering, and research and development. The loss of these high-paying, skilled jobs would be a blow to the American economy. Boeing's warning serves as a stark reminder that the SLS program is not just about space exploration. It's also about jobs, economic growth, and American competitiveness. The decisions made about the future of SLS will have far-reaching implications, extending beyond the realm of spaceflight and into the lives of thousands of American workers. The SLS is facing increasing pressure due to the emergence of more affordable, reusable alternatives. Companies like SpaceX and Blue Origin are developing rockets designed for reusability, dramatically reducing the cost of spaceflight. SpaceX's Starship is a fully reusable spacecraft and launch system, designed to carry both crew and cargo to Earth orbit, the Moon, Mars, and beyond. Blue Origin's New Glenn is another heavy-lift launch vehicle, designed to be partially reusable. Both rockets promise significant cost savings compared to the SLS. The development of reusable rockets represents a paradigm shift in space exploration, challenging the traditional model of expendable rockets. These new systems have the potential to make spaceflight more accessible and sustainable driving down costs and opening up new possibilities for exploration. The emergence of these new players is forcing NASA to reconsider its approach. The agency is under pressure to reduce costs and accelerate the pace of exploration. The future of the SLS hinges on whether it can compete with these more economical alternatives. Starship and New Glenn not quite ready for prime time. While Starship and New Glenn offer promising alternatives, they are not yet ready for human lunar missions. Both rockets are still in development. They face significant technical hurdles before they can be certified for human spaceflight. Starship, the more ambitious of the two, has yet to reach orbit. SpaceX is conducting a series of test flights. These tests are designed to refine the rocket's design and capabilities. However, the timeline for crewed missions to the moon remains uncertain. New Glenn, while further along in its development, is also not yet ready for crewed missions. The rocket is expected to make its first flight soon, but it will still require extensive testing and development before it can carry humans to the moon. Despite these limitations, the rapid progress of Starship and New Glenn cannot be ignored. These rockets represent a new era of spaceflight. They have the potential to revolutionize access to space. This makes them serious contenders for future lunar missions. The China Challenge, a space race for the 21st century. The urgency surrounding America's space program is heightened by China's advancements. China has made significant strides in space exploration in recent years. It has launched astronauts into orbit, landed a rover on Mars, and is building its own space station. China's growing space capabilities challenge U.S. leadership in space. The U.S. must maintain its position at the forefront of space exploration. This competition impacts national security, innovation, and global prestige. 
The US and China are now engaged in a new space race. It's a competition for technological supremacy and global influence. The future of the US space program will shape this rivalry. The challenge from China underscores the strategic importance of a robust space program. The US must invest in innovation and inspire future generations. The stakes are high, economy, politics, and national pride. The decision about the SLS program's future is fraught with economic and political implications. Canceling the program would have significant job impacts. It could also lead to political fallout, particularly in states with a large aerospace industry presence. Boeing, recognizing the stakes, is likely to make strategic moves to garner political support for the SLS program. The company may highlight the program's economic benefits. It may emphasize its role in maintaining American leadership in space. These efforts could sway lawmakers and influence the final decision. Beyond the economic and political considerations, the SLS program also carries symbolic weight. It represents America's commitment to space exploration and its technological prowess. Canceling the program would be seen by some as a retreat from America's role as a global leader in space. The SLS program is at a crossroads. Its fate hangs in the balance. The decision facing lawmakers is not just about a rocket. It's about jobs, national pride, and America's place in the cosmos. A defining moment for NASA and America's spacefaring legacy. NASA and Congress face a pivotal choice they must decide the fate of the SLS program. This decision will have far-reaching consequences for America's future in space exploration. It will shape the nation's approach to spaceflight for decades to come. Continuing to fund the SLS would demonstrate a commitment to NASA's current plans for human exploration. However, it would come at a high cost. This could potentially limit the agency's ability to pursue other scientific endeavors. Alternatively, Pivoting to more affordable alternatives like Starship or New Glenn could usher in a new era of sustainable and accessible spaceflight. However, this approach carries its own risks. It relies on the successful development and testing of these new systems. The choices made today will determine the course of America's spacefaring future. They will shape the nation's ability to explore the cosmos, inspire future generations, and secure its place as a leader in space exploration. The stakes are high, and the time for decision is now.